Hey everyone, Red Spirit here. The Red Spirit, Cyber Dot 20. Let's watch Jupiter Jazz, Part 2, Episode 13 of Cowboy Bebop. Let's, let's play it. 3, 2, 1, play. I was in the same squadron as Vicious on Titan comrades, but I'm attracted to that word, point of tears. We were all comrades. What's that song? Julia. Nice melody. You mind if I play that tune on my sax when I get back home? When I came home from the war, they put me in prison. So they gave me some new drug. They and the side effects, well, my hormones went out of balance. And this is what happened. Why are you going to see Vicious? Didn't you say he framed you? He'll murder you. Death does not frighten me. You're lying. Why did you bring me here? Maybe I wanted to be with someone. I, I don't know. <laughs> what the hell? Is she crazy? Why she are you that? sure it was this Julia? About two years ago, she wandered in out of the blue. A month later, she disappeared. Yeah? What kind of girl was she? She was a real woman. Does Jed not know about Julia? It's like I'm watching a dream. When this is over, I'm getting out of it. Will you come with me? Are you going to betray me? Please. They're going to kill you. My left eye sees the past. What about your right eye? I'm not dead. How about that? Ah! Tranquilizer guns, they're mocking me. They smoke a lot in this show. Come on, forget it. <laughs> this I don't guy's want anything to do with foreigners ever again. <laughs> I'm gonna do that. Huh? <laughs> wow. What, the... what luck. Hey! Uh, it's you. What the hell is this all about? Oh, I get it. He's one of those kind of guys, huh? Julia was here. I love this song. No. I got a lead. Catch him yourself. This guy's codenamed Julia. His name's Grin. Escaped from a military prison. If you catch him, I'll let you back on. And it's closest to the sky. I'll send a woman over. Who is this Julia? I don't know. You got some kind of hold on Spike. That's all I can tell you. <laughs> what is that? Where's doing? my souvenir? <laughs> I love those two. Tell Grin that I send my regards. Doesn't you know. saved me from that scorpion, and yet, you lied and sold me down the river. Oh. Nice. It's you. What do you want? When you gave me that music you box, you didn't... Are you trying to kill me again? Is that it? We were comrades. Just everything, shoulder to shoulder, on that battleground of death. There's no need to believe. So this is look out! <gasps> there is nothing in this world to believe in. Vicious! Lynn died protecting you. Bull is lost. He wasn't protecting me, don't you get it? He was protecting the order. You're in the way. Oh no, Jen. <laughs> Got 
That was so cool. Grin, tell me where Julia is. I've got to find her. <coughs> You've got an internal injury. I don't know if an ambulance will even come out to this place. I want to go to Titan. You can't make it there in this condition. It would take too long. I want to go back one last time. If I can't do that, then at least I'll be on my way. I get it now. You're the one, aren't you? You're Spike. Julia was always talking about you. Your eyes are different colors. Said you get a strange feeling if you keep looking straight into his eyes. And then she would smile. Oh, what a smile. What are you bringing in? Nothing. Hurry up and get inside. We're taking off. Julia. What'd you say? Where'd you guys go, anyway? Someplace very good. How come Edward got left out? Ed, anything but blue. A star just fell from the sky. That is not an ordinary star, my son. That star is the tear of a warrior. Let's full circle. A pitiful soul who could not find his way to the lofty realm where the great spirit awaits us all. This is the halfway episode. I'm serious. Let's look at that. It's very heavy. Kind of stuff.